What's up guys? Hope everyone's having a great day today. Today's video is going to be something new. It's going to be like a Town Hall 13 Legends League fail attack video. So the original idea for this video was going to be a Town Hall 13 base defense review. And I was going to show you guys all these defenses I had in my battle log recently. Like I had 14 straight defenses, not getting 3 starred. But then I started watching the replays to show you guys like how good the base was. And then I realized how bad these attackers are. I swear you will see some of the worst attackers you have ever seen today in this video if you watch it. Like these guys have maxed out heroes and just watching them attack it, bl it blows my mind. I don't know what to say. You guys just got to watch the replays for yourself and find out. Real quick looking at the defense log I'm only going to be showing you guys maxed out hero attacks and mostly maxed out troop attacks. None of that level 5 world champion level 50 king attacks. Maxed out heroes, maxed out troops let's start it off with this attack right here all right so this attack right here starts a little late so i'm gonna fast forward it a little bit the guy's got 13 bowlers nine valkyries quad quake and three healers interesting all right let's see how he does it starting the queen off around seven o'clock okay queen charge with three healers like queen walk maybe oh there comes the seven wizards world champion king warden starting it off fast oh my goodness 13 bowlers in the same spot Quad Quake in, activates the Town Hall, okay, interesting. There goes his Valkyries, oh, some nice Wall Breakers. Warden ability in, nice timing, oh, nice Rage Spell right there. Oh, second Rage Spell, you know, you gotta secure that Town Hall. Oh, freeze it too, why not? Half his Bowlers die, Poison Spell was late. Looking like a great attack so far, guys. Let's speed it up, most of the troops are dead. Mostly just the heroes left here. And oh my goodness, this is just the first attack, guys. Like I'm telling you, it gets worse from here. This is probably one of the better ones, honestly. Yeah. And he spends a minute, 30 seconds watching one archer take some gold. Oh my goodness. Moving on to the second attack, we got a maxed out hero, Lalo. Let's watch this one. All right, so when I first watched this attack, when I was trying to make the Tunnel 13 defense base review, I thought this guy was a complete bot. You guys got to see this one. 3 Lava Hounds, 34 Balloons, 10 Minions. Just watch how he does the Lala. Like... What? And he's got a Wall Wrecker. Doesn't even use his Warden. Like, how are people in Legends League? I don't understand. Is it this easy? To get there? Watch his Haste Spell on the Town Hall. The, watch the wall wrecker. Just watch the wall wrecker. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> oh my goodness. Still has 10 minions though for some cleanup. Don't worry. And he has his king and queen. Like, how? How did you get here, Biff? How did you get to Legends League? I need to know. Doesn't even drop his queen in here to take out the town hall. It walks around to the gold mine. Gold storage. I don't know how people are in Legends League, honestly. People think it's hard to get there? No. This is the type of people you attack in Legends League. And the type of people that will attack you. Oh my. For our third attack, we got like a Yeti Bow Witch attack with a blimp. Solid. Everything looks maxed out. Besides a minion and an archer, actually. Let's see how this guy does it. Gonna quad quake the center. Open up three compartments. Okay. Not too bad of a start. Let's fast forward it up. He's going to queen charge the top of the base. Okay. Wall breakers fail. Okay. No test wall breakers. One coconut loon. You know, not too bad so far. Okay. Warden and king on the other side of the queen. Oh, queen turns around. He gets lucky. Yeti to funnel. Okay. Solid job. Oh, you need to set that funnel better. Wait, he has no more wall breakers. How does he expect to get in the base? You don't have any wall breakers, buddy. You forgot your wall breakers. Oh, there's a hole there. Wait, I'm stupid. Okay, anyways. <laughs> Let's keep going with this. He has one free spell, poison, and a rage left. Blimp is in. Doesn't warden over the blimp. It's not going to make it to the town hall. His troops are all over the place. Like, are you going to use that last rage spell or are you going to save it for the next attack? What? Oh, there's some yetis in the core. Maybe they'll take out the town hall. Tornado trap. Like, let's fast forward this one. Nothing left here. 
Queen's gonna die off soon, use its ability. Town Hall is gonna survive, melt those Yetis and King. The people attacking me in Legends League, I swear, I don't know what's going on, man. Like, what am I watching? All right, this one right here is one of my personal favorites. This is the last one I watched before I decided to cancel last video and make a Town Hall 13 fail attack video. <laughs> this one, it's mind blowing that people attack like this. All right, watch this. One Rage, eight Freezes, and a Poison. You know, three Super Archers, three Healers, some E-Drags, and some Dragons. All right, he's going to start it off with his uh, three healer queen walk up top. And then a warden behind the queen. Uh, what? A ground warden on your air attack. Okay, then he's going to drop his wall wrecker. Okay, you know. Why not? Maybe that queen will go in there, take out that eagle. Okay. Not too bad so far. Wait, you got to freeze. You got to help your wall wrecker get to the core. Oh, he freezes that multi. No comment on these free spells. Wait, was anything in his wall wrecker? Poison, okay, nice poison. Looking good so far. <laughs> Just wait, it gets better. Freezes that multi. Okay, why not, you know? Okay. World champion ability early. Alright. Can't knock him. Alright, queen ability. Oh, nice free spell over there. World champion falls. <laughs> These attacks are so funny. Look at this warden ability. <laughs> oh my god. And then he freezes for his warden. Doesn't take out the multi, so he drops one dragon. <laughs> drops one dragon to take out the multi. It does its, jo it does its job, I think. Now you have three e drags, four e drags, three dragons, and a rage bell left. How is he gonna attack now? <laughs> At this point, I think he's attacking for loot. Maybe he's trying to farm. No, cause he's not going for the storages. All right, so you know your dragons are in. E drags are one of them's in. Oh, you drop one up here. Got to fast forward this. It's gonna take forever. Come on, buddy. You have two E-Drags left. Does he even use them? 48 seconds. No way. I never got to this far in the attack. Oh, there they are. There they are. Oh, what a placement. Got that storage. Wow. Oh, my goodness. I think he was farming, actually. Maybe he was just farming. No, I think he... I swear. I think he was doing regular attack. Oh, this poor E-Drag can't get a strike off. <laughs> Uh, this this is insane. I tell you this is insane. All right, this attack right here might be the best attack We're gonna watch can't really tell I'm just looking at the army. He's got a pretty solid hybrid army comp He even has super wall breakers. So let's see how this one goes He's got a blimp good a good blimp for this town hall better use a blimp and not a siege barracks probably Let's see how this guy does it He's even got five healers like unlike the other guys that use like three You know solid funnel. Okay, he's gonna queen walk the eagle good start to the base he is going to walk into those multi-infernos, though, so not the best idea. Good poison. Wow. Wow. Best attacker I've seen yet. Actually, a bad poison, because Lava Hound's late, and that poison's not going to affect the rest of those pups. Just realized that. So Queen's going to have to pop ability, because the poison's early. Alright, let's see how he does now. Queen's going to die. He's not going to invest any free spells in it. Healers are going to king walk. You know, we love king walks out here. Oh, here comes the hybrid. No funnel needed. Just just bam into the middle of the base. King? Screw the king. Poison? Yeah, good poison over there on that scatter shot. Oh, we got a blimp with the warden ability? That's the best blimp I've seen all all the attacks so far. Yeti's in there. Going to take out the town hall. Wow. This is by far the best attack we've ever seen. And I think he gets like a 67%. Like, the, I don't, I don't, I don't understand. How? 63%. All right, we got a mass hog rider attack coming up next. Let's see how this one goes. Let's fast forward it. He's attacking from the bottom. Oh, I did not expect that. Okay. Gonna queen charge into a multi inferno. 
Okay, you know, there you go. Nice wall breakers there. Yeah. A few healers will die. One. Oh, did they all survive? I think they all survived. Okay. It's not going too bad so far. You know, a rage and a freeze to get in there. Solid start. Oh, queen does goes 10 IQ. Doesn't go for the town hall. Unfortunate. Coconut Loon. Well, this is a half decent attacker. Let's see how he does this here. Coming up soon. Is this queen going to be able to... T he what? Was that a rage spell and a heal spell on top of the queen? What? We're going to have to play the rest of the attack. Mass Hog's coming in. He's probably just going to be able to blimp this town hall. Warden blimp. Actually doesn't even use the warden. Rage the Hog Riders. No, nothing to take out. The defensive CC. Doesn't even use his poison. Oh my goodness. Oh, the RC ability saved him. Doesn't even use the poison. Poisons are overrated anyways. All right, I got one bonus attack. I know this one's not maxed out heroes. It's the only attack without maxed out heroes. But when I saw 10 lightning strikes and two earthquakes, I, I couldn't not put it in the video. Come on. I've never seen an attack in Legends League without a rage spell. Like... That's mind blowing. Not even one. I understand maybe one rage spell, but not even one. See how this guy does it. He's gonna use ten lightning strikes probably around here. Take out those scatter shots. He's thinking right now. He's like, where should I put all my lightning spells? Where can I get the most value? <laughs> all right, there they go. Five and five. Then the two earthquakes on top. All right, he got two scatter shots. And three expos with 12 spell slots. Okay. Yeah, he's not the best, but not the worst. All right, so here comes his queen charge into the multi. Does he have a wall breaker? He doesn't need it because he's got a wall wrecker. All right, healers are start going to start getting hit. Queen turns around, goes back into the base. Need to drop his yetis and his warden and his RC ASAP. There they go. This is the funniest part right here. Doesn't even save his wall wrecker with his warden ability. Where are you expecting to go from here? <laughs> eagle smacking the troops. Now you use a warden after two eagle strikes. Troops are splitting. RC went to the right. The rest of the troops went to the left. You only got one free spell, no rage. What do you expect to do? Like, you have an ice golem in there? Oh my goodness. Don't think you have a poison spell, obviously, because he used 10 lightning strikes. Yetis are doing work on the collectors outside. This attack, man. These people in Legends League. Whoever said Legends League was ever hard, if anyone ever said that, they're wrong. Let them know. Let them know. Anyone can make it to Legends League. If you're 10-all-13 after watching this video, anyone can make it. Anyone. Anyone. That's going to be it for the 10-all-13 Legends League fail attacks i don't even know what to call this video those attacks were hilarious if you guys watched them all let me know in the comments if you couldn't make it through all of those attacks i understand that was a pain my eyes did start to bleed like five attacks in at that sixth attack i i don't know if i can make it anymore at the seventh attack i think i zoned out like i said though that's the end of the video thanks for watching appreciate it so much guys if you watched this far make sure to like drop a comment likes and comments really boost the channel make the video get recommended to others subscribe if you haven't already become a member too if you haven't already would appreciate that a ton and yeah thanks for watching peace out